What's up, guys? Jay Little here for more Pack Crackers. I got it is yours for Thursday, first of all, in Ravnica Allegiance, and you don't know what that means. I got a whole new box. Ooh, it's all fresh and new. Look how smooth and pretty it is. All blue. But uh, we're gonna be opening up this box here. You can see me. Hi. There's. Uh, you can kind of see my reflection. Um, but what I was gonna say. Ravnica Allegiance, uh, the new set, newest set that came out. I'm gonna open up the box, and as is per usual on yours for Thursdays, where I got a new box, pretty much a guaranteed giveaway. Now, as I try to figure out how to open up the plastic wrapper around it, there we go. I'll explain uh, yours for Thursday rules um, to win. First of all, I have to get a mythic. I'm going to open up packs until I do, so there's a pretty good chance I will. There is a small chance, I guess, that I won't be getting a mythic, but that's slim to none. I would hope that in this entire box, I'll get at least one mythic. One can hope. But uh, anyway, uh, to win the mythic that I give away, uh, you got to do a couple things, three things. You got to be subscribed to my channel, like the video, and uh, comment on the video. You can do something simple like tell me your favorite card from Ravnica Allegiance, how you would use the mythic if you win it, and that sort of thing. Um, or just say, hey, good vid. But um, uh, for international viewers, I'm not going to be able to ship out any more cards internationally. I'm sorry. Um, if you'd still like to play along and win, I can uh, get you like a TCG player uh, gift card or some kind of a gift card that you can try to use in your country uh, to have it shipped out or what have you uh, which is op optional I'm sitting I'm at a plastic table I'm not sitting on a plastic table but I'm at a plastic table that I'm recording this and if you push down a little bit the thing because it's right in the middle you can see the crack here in the middle it's one of those folding deals push it down a little bit get a little workout you can see it moving. So if, it, if I do that a lot, it's because I'm leaning on it or something. But anyway, international viewers, I can't get you the card, but I can get you a gift card uh, electronically. Um, everybody else, uh, I'm going to pick the winner next Thursday for those people who do those three things I mentioned earlier. So let's give a card away, shall we? And also, one other thing, I'm running out of breath because I forgot to breathe in that last minute and a half, I think. Okay, I'm good. So we're going to open up uh, packs until we get a mythic. I'm going to go through them real quick. But I do like to do a bit of that when I get a new box. Just like to dump some out. And we'll sort them later. This guy wants to go first. Now I'm going to go through the commons. And uncommons real quick. Talk about the rares and mythics if I get one. Um, so we'll look through them here. Uh, remember, you can pause and read about, read about any of them that you want to. So there's that you can do. Uh, Sage's Rose Savant. Rubble Belt Recluse. Uh, I'm not even going to read through them, actually. Not even going to read the damn names, man. Just going to go through them. Like I said, pause and read about them. Um, if you want to. See so if you get a Mythic in the first pack. Nope. A Biomass is familiar, though. That is uh, from the Simic. Uh, Simic is my favorite guild. Uh, second favorite is Orzov, both of which are in this set. But Biomass is Familiar is a 2-2 mutant. Activated abilities of creatures you control cost 2 less to cast, to activate, I should say. This effect can't reduce the amount of mana and ability costs to activate, costs to activate less than 1 mana. Okay. Uh, tap, and next time target creature adapts this turn, it adapts as though it had no plus one plus one counters on it. That's cool. Adapt is a new mechanic. Uh, adapt N, I guess they call it, where you put that many counters on it, if, if it doesn't have any counters on it or something like that. Um, so hopefully, we'll get ourselves a, a mythic here in this pack. I like getting the mythics early. Because then I have more packs to open for you guys on different episodes. Granted, I'm going to open up the same amount of packs either way. But, uh, you know, I'm trying to keep these on camera for you. Not a mythic, uh, but it is Deputy of Detention. So, uh, Deputy of Detention, I'm trying to keep it on camera so where you can kind of see it. Um, it's one, a blue, and a, and a white. Yeah, I got it right. Uh, one, three, Vidalkin Wizard. 
Uh, when it enters the battlefield, exile target non-land permanent and opponent controls and all other non-land permanents that player controls with the same name as that permanent until deputy of detention leaves the battlefield. Good for, you know, control deck, uh, which is what uh, Azorius is well known for. Uh, last time we went to Ravnica, their, uh, uh, what was it? Their mechanic was uh, Detain, which is really brutal. But, uh, yeah, ooh, that's cool artwork. I like that. Uh, also, uh, I really want for myself, and for you guys if I get one, uh, is Simic Ascendancy. It's an alternate win condition card for, for Simic. And I got another rare. Got an Incubation Druid, another Simic card. This is one and a green for 0-2 Elf Druid. Tap to add one man of any type that a land you control could produce. If this has a plus one, plus one counter on it, add three of that type instead. And you can adapt three for three and two green. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Open up another one. Uh, last time I had a box, I got another box of Ravnica, or Guilds of Ravnica. And I got the, uh, got the Mythic in two packs. Around, what, pack three, I think? Still no Mythics. So let's hopefully, well, let's hope I don't go through all of these cards. I'm just trying to get one. A reprint of Gateway Plaza, which was in the last set, but that's cool, whatever. Could have thrown us something else there. Yeah, got some of this. And Mythic! Nope, it's another rare. This one is one of the splitty splits. This is a uh, Warrant to Warden. Warrant and Warden. Warrant is a uh, blue and a white and a blue or a white. Blue or a white and a blue or a white. It's an instant put target attacking or blocking creature on top of owner's library. A warden is three uh, whites and a blue. Create a 4-4 four, four, uh, white and blue sphinx creature token flying and vigilance. Uh, later this week, uh, actually tomorrow, this is the first video I'm recording. So I can kind of hint at whatever mythic I give away on uh, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday shows. But uh, this is technically the first one I'm recording here. Uh, tomorrow... Uh, I'm going to be opening up the uh, bundle pack. I almost said fat pack. It's not a fat pack anymore. Got to remember that. Uh, but I'm going to open up the bundle pack. Then I'll have the uh, two Planeswalker decks earlier on in this week. And my Mythic. Still not a Mythic. Glass of the Guild pack. That's pretty cool artwork too. Has all the guild symbols around it. Uh, two drop artifact. Multicolored creatures you control get plus one, plus one. Not too shabby. Thopter token. Uh, my camera went to screensaver. There we go. What was that? Four packs? Five packs? Something like that? Let's get one, shall we? Really like it when these videos aren't like half an hour long. And also, I have some packs left to open later. Also, a good thing. Ah, not. Oh, there we go. Uh, so, we're going to go through these. Just check and make sure everything's still on camera. Still going good there. Remember, you can always pause, read about them if you need to. I'm going to probably go through all of the commons and uncommons uh, you know, over the next couple of weeks here. Uh, my rare for this one is uh, Ver Ver Veridi? Verity? Verity Circle. Uh, it's two, a blue, uh, and for an enchantment, whenever a creature an opponent controls becomes tapped, if it isn't being declared as an attacker, you may draw a card. You can pay four and a blue to tap target creature without flying. That's cool. Good for draw deck. I have a draw deck. I like it. It's cool. So we got this one now. Open up this one. See what we got. Ah, sweet merfolk right there. Sweet old merfolk. So yeah, uh, in the storyline, uh, I guess the next set that's coming out, next big expansion, uh, Nicole Bolas is about ready to fuck some stuff up on Ravnica. Uh, got another rare. Rare artifact this time. Another rare artifact, I should say. This is Tome of the Guild Pack. Five drop artifact. Whenever you cast a multicolored spell, draw a card. And you can tap to add one mana of any color. We're about seven or eight packs in. Still no mythic. I'm going to keep opening until we get one, though. So, hopefully that will be soon for you guys. Or you just, you know, skip to the end of the video and see, you know, what, what the mythic was. Uh, I guess the longer the video, the more packs I open. So, hopefully this ends within the next minute or so. Uh-huh, uh-huh, and another rare. This one is an Orzov Tithe Taker. 
This one, I'm going to get on camera a little bit more. The camera's kind of tilted strangely. Oh, well. Uh, one and a white for a 2-1 human soldier. During your turn, spells your opponent's co cast cost one more to cast. And abilities your opponent's activate cost one more to activate unless they're mana abilities. It has Afterlife 1, which is the Orzhov mechanic. When this creature dies, put a 1-1 one, one white and black spirit creature token flying on the battlefield. Which is nice. Good way to get a little bit more out of the, uh, the creatures that you got. You know, so you're not so sad when they die, I guess. So let's get a mythic in this. We'll just, we'll just get a mythic in this pack, I guess. If we got to. Remember, pause read about them. Like I said, I'm going to go through most of these again, no doubt. Not a mythic. But a Simic split card. We got uh, Repudiate, 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 and Replicate. Okay. Uh, repudiates is two uh, either blue or greens, and it's an instant counter target ad activated or triggered ability. And replicate one a green and a blue. Uh, create a token that's a copy of target creature you control, and it's a sorcery. Uh, actually, pretty good in most cases. If you have a good creature out, I guess. If you don't have good creatures, I guess it's uh, kind of pointless. But uh, it is what it is. Go through all the commons here. Uh, hopefully, there's a lot of gold. Look at that gold. Look at all that gold. Uh, wait, wait, what? Uh, boop, boop, boop. And my mythics. There we go. Emergency powers. Uh, so, emergency powers is five blue and a white. It's an instant. Each player shuffles their hand and graveyard into the library, then draws seven cards. Exile emergency powers. Has addendum. Uh, if you cast this spell during your main phase, you may put a permanent card with a converted mana cost seven or less from your hand onto the battlefield. Not, not too bad. That's a pretty good one. Give that one away. Yeah, you guys can have this one. Uh, so that was what about 10, 11 packs, something like that. Maybe not that many. I don't know. Uh, but a stack of cards like that, though. Uh, but we got that one for you guys. Um, remember again, just to go over the rules one more time. Uh, to win the Mythic, or to have a chance to win the Mythic, you have to be a subscriber to my channel, uh, comment on this video, and like this video. And then next Thursday, I'll pick a winner uh, and, and mail the card out to them. International uh, viewers, I love you guys, but unfortunately with international shipping rates, uh, more often than not, the shipping cost is going to be more than the card's worth. So it'd just be better for both of us if I just give you a gift card, which I will. Uh, so you can get yourself a gift card. Um, instead of this card, equal to the cost of the card itself, it won't be like a two hundred dollar gift card. It'll be like five, ten bucks, depending on what the card's worth at the time that I send it out. I'll double check before I buy it. But uh, yeah. So anyway, make sure you guys do those three things, and next week uh, we'll have a winner. Uh, remember, tomorrow I'm doing bundles, the bundle pack, uh, and previous this week, you know, the Planeswalker decks and some other packs I opened. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Bye.